Hey guys, this is the CS Experience One, and I'm here today to show you guys a couple new products I bought for uh, train watching. Um, the first product I bought is actually a tripod mount, and this is what this is right here. It's a uh, actually like a weight bag. Um, I bought this off Amazon. If you go on my website, I'll put a link right to this particular bag if you want to buy the same one. It's only about uh, eleven dollars. Shipping is pretty much uh, like two bucks. It's not really bad at all. So it holds ten and a half pounds in this little pouch. Um, it's just Velcro onto your tripod. It works really good for like a lightweight backpack tripod. More of the really expensive tripods, like if once you get past like a hundred dollars, and really don't work too good on the tripods because they're a lot thicker. And I mean, it's made for a thick tripod, but it, it don't it sits up too high, I think, for a heavy duty tripod. Mine's like a five and a half foot tripod, and it works perfect on anything over that. It's not really any good. Um, if you want to get the brand name, it's this right here. So it's a pretty good little bag. It's pretty heavy duty. It's got studs and everything in it. It's really heavy. Um, I like it. It works good. Keeps it a lot better for my video cameras. Um, especially because I'm using the new iPod Touch now with the camcorder. So actually this is what this video is being used with. So uh, I'll talk about that later. But that was just one product. The next product is a scanner. But we'll talk about this at the end. Because it's going to be a full unboxing. The next thing I'm going to talk about is my iPod Touch and also my iPad. Definitely recommend buying the, like the iPod Touch for train watching. The camera is full HD. It's actually a lot better than even a full HD camcorder. A lot of you guys are saying you guys have you have an SLR. Your photos are great. Why are you using uh, just an iPod? Well, actually, the camera I have does not have a video camera in it. That's why I'm, I went out and bought the iPod. But I had one of the flip video cameras. I didn't care for that. It was only half HD. So now I'm using this a lot more for my uh, train watching because it's full HD. The iPad's also full HD, but it's a little harder to hold still. Um, I like that for uh, doing like wireless camcordering, which you can do photos with. Photos on these are not great. I don't really care for them. I mean, if you're on the go, you see a good rare power. You pull it out and take some photos. It's good there. But I definitely don't recommend using it every day if you're going to go out and just train watch. I definitely recommend buying some kind of better camcorder, even if it's like a high quality point and shoot. But enough talk about that. Let's get to the scanner because it's the main part of this video. I bought this from Scanner World online. One of my friends actually taught, told me about the website. Um, so I got it from them. It was only $89 plus shipping and handling. It was like $11. Um, not really a bad scanner, I've heard. Um, I've never tried it. Uh, never actually even seen one in person, this brand. I've, my friends use them, but I've never used one. So we're going to unbox this and see what we think. So let's cut this open. Let's see what we think. Alright, so when you first open the box, this is what we get. It's pretty much the outside of the box, it shows the make and model of the scanner. Um, it shows a picture of the scanner and all the different, oh, it's a hundred channels, uh, eight in the bank, or ten in the bank. Um, it shows all the different stuff it does. Um, it's not a bad scanner I've heard, but I've never used it yet. So let's pop this out. It's actually a NASCAR slash multi-use one. Any scanner will really do it, but as actually if you see when I zoom it close, I don't know if it'll get blurry or not, but that right there says NASCAR. Um, but that can always be removed. Underneath, there's just a couple sheets of cardboard, another sheet of cardboard, uh, and then it's just my billing slip. So I won't show you that because that's that info on it that you don't really need. And then scanner rolled, um, US A, www.scannerrolled.com. I will put a link on this, and I'll also put a link on my website if you want to go right to the scanner rolled. I'll send you just the scanner rolled, not to the particular scanner, but there's not too many scanners on scanner rolled. Um, their logo and email and fax and stuff like that. So, needless to say, there's not too too much info outside this box, but there is some. So next, we'll jump over to uh, the, pic the scanner in particular. This is the front of the box. They obviously show you the back of the box first. Don't know why. The front of it it's, is NASCAR brand, um, but it does everything as it said online. It does trains, uh, fire, police. Actually, it says right here. Uh, scans include water, police, fire, aircraft, 
uh, hammer you and more. So let's open this up and see what it's like. There we go. Top of it's pretty basic. So you open up, it's a cardboard box. Slide this out. Uh, it's another box in a box. So we open it up and pamphlets as usual. Um, sale pamphlet, uh, scanners, uh, and something else kind of pamphlet. It's probably like a warranty or something form, it looks like. Uh, scanner, something else for the scanner. Then you have your guide for your scanner. Um, and manual on how to use it and stuff. Definitely probably recommend using it. Because most people don't know how to use the scanner. That's a pretty much basic setup of it. Just show you that quick. And then we get to the power plug. All of this is pretty much looks like a basic power plug. Six looks like a six volt power plug. Yep, six volt output. So uh Pretty basic power plug, even if you lose it, I'm sure you can get other ones. But I'm saying it's got a five foot cable on it. Pretty nice, just a basic power plug. I don't say scanner roll because it's a scanner brand. You got the, I'm not gonna take this out because there's actually screws, but there's your clip and the two screws to hold it on. Your rubber ducky or antenna as people call them. And then the last thing we have in here is the scanner, in particular. It's actually a pretty small portable scanner. And this is the portable scanner alone. It takes two AAA batteries, AA batteries. Um, so it's not really bad. Fits pretty much right in the palm of my hand, so it's good size. Um, it is NASCAR, as I said. It's got all your channels, your scan, your light, your power, and programs and stuff. It, on the top, it's got a headphone jack, if you want to use that when you're out with your friends, and your friends don't want to be here, your scanner. It's got your volume, and another switch, and I'm not positive what it does. And then you also have your, uh, for your antenna. So yeah, guys, this is pretty much my uh, info on my scanner and everything like that, my tripod mount and my new iPod and iPad. Uh, look forward on my website for all different links. I'll put a website link on the bottom of this uh, video, so check out that. Also, uh, yeah, definitely check out on my website for new photos, and then also check out for the websites for all this stuff, and if you want to buy other stuff like that. Thanks, guys.